Good morning. Uh, it's July the 24th, 2019. And I thought I should make a little movie, or a little film of my gardens. So here we start with what is going to be my sort of pretty garden, but also with fruit trees and fruit bushes and strawberries and, uh, well, other edibles as well. Uh, but also with lots of flowers, roses, Austin roses, which are repeating roses and also smell absolutely fantastic. Um, I worked on this garden now for since four years and it's coming along but it's still a work in progress so um, it will just get better and better I think. Uh, borage and uh, ever everlasting strawberries they are white sweet small and just continue to give fruit all all during the summer and uh, some washer for insects oh sorry about the shadow unfortunately I have lots and lots of deer at my property they sort of have a path at the end of the field on the other side there and uh, all the dear mummies teach their children that this garden is just like the best pantry ever. So they teach them to come here and uh, forage and eat and uh, unfortunately they destroy quite a lot. So lots of branches are ruined by the deer but the tree will survive so <clears throat> hopefully it will be okay. So here we have comfrey, rhubarb, uh, blackcurrant, some kale, fennel, no, I think it's anise, and squash, roses, uh, more anise. Um, I removed a blackcurrant, no, a blackberry bush here, <coughs> and as a result I have one, two, three, four new ones. So I will dig them up in the autumn and uh, find new places for them. Because they were just too sticky and spreading all over. So I just couldn't have them here. Uh, there's some elderberry bushes and I planted elderberry all the way over here. It's a little bit dry for them and very sunny but they are still alive and hopefully next year they will be even better. Comfrey and peonies, two peonies bushes. My greenhouse uh, is doing okay. Sorry about the mess. But there are some tomatoes with flowers, some peppers, some chilies. Here you can see some plants already. Um, Fisales, uh, still things that should be planted out, some cucumbers, chilies, basil, Thai basil, uh, oregano. Um, I was a little bit late getting started this year. It's a dogwood outside. And my aronia bushes are doing great. And I planted them the spring four years ago, maybe, or three. They were just about an inch and a half tall and most of them, I planted 450 of them, so I planted a lot and most of them have survived, so they are growing and uh, it will be a good yield this summer. Last summer was so hot and dry, so it was not very good, but this year seems to be lots and lots of berries coming. So I have two sweet cherry trees, two plum trees, three apple trees, uh, comfrey, uh, 
chives, goji berry, uh, blackberries, uh, roses, squash, um, delphiniums, I think, some yellow raspberries over there. Uh, the deer also destroyed more or less four of these tuya. I'm not quite sure what they're called in English. Hopefully they will survive and uh, get back uh, next year. And so there are peonies here, there are blueberries, foxgloves, different types of lilies. Uh, so I'm trying to do some companion planting, both wanting it to be pretty and functional and also give me some yield. So in between there are sweet peas, squashes, curly kale, chives, currants, um, or blueberries, goji berries. Uh, we had a very warm spring, very, very warm, and things blossomed way too early. And then we had three days of minus eight, ten degrees. Uh, so, unfortunately, there won't be a lot of fruit on the trees this year. But there are a couple of apples here, a few apples, a couple of apples over there. But that's okay. The trees need to get even more established. And the aronia, <laughs> some places is, are almost as tall as I am, and I'm like five, f five seven. Um, so this garden is coming along, and my favorite place, of course, to sit is here in my hammock where I have a beautiful view over my fields. So, I hope you enjoyed this little video and uh, that you can see things are getting along nicely. And next year it will be even better. Bye from now, from Mystic Dreamer from Norway.